Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel first of all before I start this q and I I want to say thank you so much everyone for pouring in so much of your love your support I did not do anything I did not deserve this love but thank you so much everybody all I can tell you guys is thank you and God bless you all so this q and I asked you guys to ask me some few questions on my Instagram and I received couple of questions from you guys so I am going to try my best to answer all the questions I don't know if it will be possible but I will try my best to answer all of your questions all right how does it feel to be a youtuber is it a hard and complicated job to do and this person also said I'm a big fan of yours thank you so much well how does it feel I it doesn't feel anything uh -huh. It is something that I love to do, so I don't really feel anything. Before I got like a full-time job, it was pretty easy for me to, you know, just sit at home, edit videos. But right now, I have a 9-to-5 job and it can be quite challenging because I have to plan for content, then I have to shoot, then edit. So that kind of becomes quite a hassle for me. But apart from that, YouTube is fun and... Also, I try to, uh, you know, bring out the best content I can for you guys. So, yeah, I would say it's not complicated, but it becomes a little hard for me to manage the time. Before I move on to the next question, here is a good news for all of you. Introducing Crickex, India's premier sports and gaming application. Register now and instantly receive a 300 rupee bonus. Don't miss out on this fantastic offer. Join the excitement with Crickex and stand a chance to win a brand new iPhone 15 Pro every week. Invite your friends and earn a 300 rupees referral bonus for each one who joins. Plus, celebrate your special day with a 1000 rupees birthday bonus. Enjoy playing every year game with an exclusive 10% cashback from Crickex. Cakes. So don't wait any longer, click the link in the comment section to get started with Quick Cakes and enjoy all the amazing offers and bonuses waiting for you. And that's not all, elevate your gaming experience with Quick Cakes Aviator game, so join now, link in the comment section. Please solve the problem between you and JP, wanna see both of you together. I think I have cleared this question, like I even told you guys on my last Q&A. Like we had a good friendship bond, yes, that I will not deny but sometimes you know like it's better to part ways and for me for my side i've ended things for good like our friendship and i do not want to revisit and a lot of people are like why are you not giving him credit he was the one to you know um, make you non even in the youtube community and i thank him for that i never said he wasn't the one yes he did push me a lot to create and also he also helped me a lot in this journey but um you know sometimes like said it's better to part ways than to stick in the same circle and i believe it was not healthy for me so i did that for me and i think all of you should respect that also you guys should also respect him by not you know going to his uh, channel and telling him oh, what happened between you and Eva and also you guys coming here to my channel and saying what's happening between you and JP like we have ended our friendship for good and I hope that makes it clear for all of you I don't want to be repeating the same thing over and over again and in the same circle again so yeah what's the weirdest rumor you've heard about yourself weirdest rumor i have heard i like i heard so many rumors about me okay my friends and my dear ones always comes to me and they're like you know we heard this about you we heard that about you but one rumor that i heard about me oh my gosh i, <laughs> I think it was a couple of months back i heard that i mean somebody i don't know they're love spreading false rumors they said that like i had a thing with a pastor and uh, that i was asked to step down from the church <laughs> which is absolutely not true <laughs> so i was like what i've been serving in like one church for the longest time and i've i'm also in a worship team and that never happened so jokes on you <laughs> <laughs> so it's not weird but it's funny how people can make up stories as such 
it's not a question but a request please do make vlogs with your boyfriend well he is camera shy the smile. <laughs> I won't say camera shy, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, he just doesn't want to appear in videos. I don't know why. <laughs> Maybe after we get married, I'll force him to come in and say hi to you guys. How many kids do you want in the future? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> if God says two, I'll say yes. If God says three, I'll happily say yes. If God says four, that also I definitely say yes but yeah whatever he decides but um <laughs> but i would love to have like at least three two or three. one do you dream of getting married before 30 years or after oh my gosh a lot of marriage questions boyfriend questions Kids, is this a sign? Main nahi bataunga. <laughs> but yeah, I would love to get married before I turn 30. Like that's like my dream. I really want to get married before 30, which is in two years time. <laughs> Are you wrong my tribe? So see a lot of confusion about whether I'm Ao or South Indian or wrong my. I have spoken about this a lot, but let me just clarify it again since you guys are very confused my dad's dad is south indian my dad's mom is wrong my and my mom is like pure ow so my dad is south indian and wrong my mix and my mom pure ow okay so i've been using jamir for the longest time but then i was like no i have to use my dad's title but my dad is south indian right but when we were very little my sister and i um my grandmother they were like just just give them wrong my the title wrong my because they'll grow up they would want to look for jobs and like we're all settled in Naglin and what if you know we don't get a job and all those concerns were there so my grandmother was like just give them uh, instead of using the south uh, title surname just give them wrong my so that's how it happened but i don't know i don't know how to speak wrong my I also don't know how to speak Malayalam. I just know how. I understand Chungli and I can speak Mongsen. The most embarrassing moment legit around 20s era. I have an interesting <laughs> story to tell you guys. Control. My friend invited me for a wedding. So we went, uh, I went for work and then um, right after my work was done, we were like, okay, Chala, let's go. I got dressed, we went to the wedding and we were just sitting there to receive the bride and groom and then we, we stood up because we have to stand right when the bride and groom enters after the wedding. We couldn't uh, like attend the formal service but after the wedding party, you know, we were there. We sit there and then the bride and groom, they were supposed to come and they requested us to stand. So we stood up, my friend and I. So my friend invited me, okay? So we went and we stood up and she was like, Eva. I was like, what? She said, shit. I was like, what happened? <laughs> and she went, we are at the wrong wedding. I was like, what? Oh my God. <laughs> it was the wrong wedding, but it was in the same time. But then it was elsewhere. She was like, what? We're at the wrong wedding. It was so embarrassing, but we just keep up by now now we were there so ini bad kai she bad kai ina she even paid the money like the <laughs> the money <laughs> so she went to the reception and she was like so sorry we had a wrong wedding but it's my friend's wedding but i did not know it was here so can i take the an envelope back <laughs> it was so funny but yeah, that was the most embarrassing moment for me. I mean, I did not know anyone there, so it's okay for me. But my friend, like, she did not even attend her friend's wedding. And on top of that, wrong wedding, nah. So that was embarrassing. <laughs> not performing these days. I am. Also, I have lots of shows coming up. I will be visiting Mon very soon. So people from Mon, 
be ready i cannot wait to see you guys and perform for you guys um there is this even then idol amit paul he'll be coming so i will also be performing alongside so i'm pretty excited and of course i'm excited to perform but more than that i'm excited to meet all of you and people of mon they're amazing i've been to mon once and like said people of mon are so pure they're so welcoming and i cannot wait to come and meet all of you there and who is your first priority my first priority is god like whatever it is god comes first before anyone like even before my mom so god comes first then family then the rest <laughs> all right so that's it for today thank you so much everybody for watching the q and a till the end thanks and also thank you so much for subscribing to my channel i know it's going to take quite some time but i i'm excited i cannot wait for my channel to hit 100k subs so please help me to reach this milestone and of course it's all possible because of you guys only you guys have been you know like consistently and diligently watching my videos and also pouring in so much love so thank you so much for that and i hope you will continue to do so i will be signing off right now thank you so much everybody once again for watching and much love to you guys and always be happy Bye-bye.